Good morning, we're at Chessington World of Adventure for the start of the 2020 season. It's the merely annual pass order day today, so it's where they kind of open the park uh, for a limited amount of merely annual pass orders. We've been lucky enough to get tickets. Ray, we've just ran to get the first train of the season on Vampire, and it was running really well. Unfortunately though, they've changed the audio in the station, and I prefer the original audio. Uh, I assume it'll grow on me though, it'll grow on me the new audio. Uh, bear in mind he'll listen to it for about two minutes because we wasn't in the station for long so we got first train. But yeah, I prefer the old soundtrack I think. It's just original, there's something about it. Um, but in the station they've changed the animatronic that plays the organ. Uh, that's actually playing the organ instead, just sat still now. Um, and yeah, like it still looks really nice in there. Uh, I feel like they've changed, I think they've changed the queue line path. Uh, it seems like it anyway, it looks new. Uh, so yeah, like everything, um, it's been great to get back on Vampire. Shame about the audio because I do like the original soundtrack. Uh, so yeah, uh, and I'm not sure whether it's on one or two trains, but it's now on a 120 minute queue, that's two hours. So yeah, it was worth running to it first. I don't know what we're going to do next, probably Dragon's Fury, uh, but yeah. So Vampire was on a 120 minute queue. Um, pretty busy over there. Don't know whether it's on one or two trains, hopefully it's on two. But yeah, like, glad I ran to it, it was running really smooth. And yeah, I don't know what we're going to do now, it's starting to rain, which is a shame. But yeah, I'm looking forward to getting on everything again. Uh, Dragon Fury, we can see over here. Tiger Rock. We'll get on it all in a bit. So it was Mum and Dad's first Chessington ride of 2020. And they're stuck on it. Great. Yeah. So they've had a good start to, oh, hey, it's something running again. Wonderful. No, no it's not. Oh well, this, so they've got stuck on the first ride of 2020. They're off to a great start. And they're getting off. <laughs> Let's go around to the exit and uh, find, find out more about what. So they've probably sent like one ride round with people on it this season. And it's already down. Great. Don't know whether mum and dad got the ride or not. Or whether they've just had to get off before the ride actually started. I don't know, we'll have to see. Yay, they're on. We're finally on. Right then, so they didn't get the full cycle on Cobra. They're still stuck on there. The ride stopped again. So we've decided to go on Dragon's Fury. The key's gone down a bit now from all the you know, first ride crowds, if you know what I mean, where everyone just runs to exit stage in the entrance to the park. So yeah, it's on 50 minutes, not bad. And uh, yeah, um, will there still be sat on there at the end of our 50 minute queue? Hopefully not. I don't know. Uh, but yeah, we're ending on Dragon's Fury. Right, so we've just come off at Dragon's Fury. It said 50 minutes, it was 20. So yeah, not too bad there. Uh, running really well, I enjoyed that. Uh, yeah, good ride. And also, we had a nice chat with Thrill Ride Photography that was behind us in the queue. So yeah, it was nice to talk to them. Uh, obviously, they have a great uh, Instagram and all that, a good YouTube channel as well. So yeah, check them out, Thrill Ride Photography. Uh, definitely worth it. Uh, so yeah, I think we're ready to tiger up now. The log flume. She's getting, um, getting sanitised. I just touched that. Just touch bars. Yeah. Shane into Tiger Rock. One of my favourites, this one. Really enjoy it. So, I'll see you in there. Really enjoying the soundtrack around here. We'll be getting on the ride in a bit. My mum and dad are on there, so we're going to wait for them. They are 20 minutes. Like, no, they're not on. No. Maybe it is around 20 minutes. Looks a bit more accurate than what Dragon Fury was. So, yeah. We're forward to it. Hopefully, the audio is on the station because. It's definitely one of my favourite ride stations and you'll probably see why in a minute. Hey! <laughs> Finley got a bit wet. Here they are, we're spying on them as they ride. Tiger Rock. Hey! Right, let's meet him at the entrance. I know, so 
You look a bit wet and unusual from Tiger Rock. Yeah, yeah. Don't normally get you that wet. That was the first drop. Wow. That was the first drop. The first drop does go normally get you wetter than the second. Bill yeah, said it said on it again. Is the soundtrack on in the station? No. Uh, yeah. Oh, thank God for that. Yeah, sorry. Wow, you made me panic then. Thank you. Right, here we go. This is my favourite ever ride station that I've been in so far. Look at it. And the soundtrack builds the atmosphere in here as well. All, all the fun lighting on the, on the wall. It looks, it looks and sounds really nice. And that's why it's my favourite station. I love it here at Tiger Rock at Chessington World of Adventures. Let's get on the back. So it was nice to get back on Tiger Rock. Uh, the only bad thing about it was the, the little dark ride section. Not everything was working, I don't think. But yeah, it was nice to get on it. Then we had an hot dog in the hot dog shop. Uh, from the hot dog shop across from the exit and entrance to Tiger Rock. So uh, we was going to go on it again after we'd finished. But it's down, it's down now, so yeah. Uh, Dragon's Fury is quiet, do you want to go there first? We was going to head to Vampire, but I think we should go to... So we should have another ride on Dragon's Fury while we're here. And my plans. Yeah, I'm really enjoying Dragon's Fury today. I enjoy it more than what I remember. Um, really enjoying it. <laughs> then we went for a nice ride on the Gruffalo, which is a dark ride. Really enjoyed that as well, you know, nice dark ride. Uh, always lots to see, lots going on. And yeah, now we're for our second ride of the day on Vampire. It said it's a 40 minute queue. Might be a bit shorter. Might be a bit shorter because it's not like, oh well, yeah. It depends if the extension bits, it depends if you're queuing all around, but yeah. It says 40 minutes. If it is 40, it's worth it. If it isn't, then woohoo. So yeah, it looks like it will be around 40 minutes. Like I said, it's worth it. The original, you know, nice low. I'm not going to sing it. Uh, soundtrack like it used to do. Um, yeah, it's shame about that because I really liked it. But uh, yeah, I mean, it still looks good in there. Like I said, we'll get a closer look at the organ thing over there when we get over there in a bit. But because that looks amazing. Right. Okay. Soundtrack isn't the only thing that takes the worst on this ride. I'm sorry to be controversial because I know a lot of people like it. But the dispatch announcement, you know, the sit back full time, the vampire is deep in flight. That's a different one. Listen to this. But obviously, it's not being dispatched now, but they've changed it for the worst. Um, I prefer the old one. Um, obviously, I'm one half, half, half at the end as well. Like, that used to make the ride for me, this station, with the old audio and those announcements. Uh, obviously, I still love the ride. And yeah, we'll be getting on to, but uh, oh wow, look at the lighting over there. But yeah, it's a shame about that. Oh, we've got the original soundtrack back. Hey, that's good. This is the closest look at the uh, organ man. The electronics been fixed. It looks really good with the lighting. And it's not playing the right soundtrack. It's not playing my favourite, one of my favourite theme park soundtracks. Yeah, that is no more unfortunately. These announcements, I really don't like them. Sorry. Sorry to be so negative, but I really don't like these new announcements. And the fact they've got rid of some uh, good announcements, on to use rubbish ones, that makes me dislike it worse. But yeah, never mind. Still a vampire. Turns 30 this year, that's the reason why they've done it apparently. Yeah, scaled vampire. Sorry to be so negative, but listen to this. 
I mean, it could be worse, but compared to the old one, it's not good. I'm going to show them about it now, because I've been too negative for this vlog, and I'm repeating myself, so I'm going to stop. Uh, yeah, we're on the front row, we'll be on the front row of our party, we're back right front front. Uh, yeah, so... Don't be waiting too much longer. So it was worth waiting for the front row of Vampire, really good ride. I'm not going to go on and on like I did earlier, but bring back the old soundtrack and announcements. So we enjoyed Room on the Broom, like I said, it's only my second time in there. Um, the only problem is I think they put too many people in our group, so it was a bit crowded in there and uh, yeah, it, it, it was crowded and you know, if you was at the back of the group you missed like part of it. Um, oh, yeah. So yeah, like too many people in there, our group, I think. Uh, but apart from that, yeah, fun rag or show thing, whatever. So here's a look at the, one of the new rides for 2020 at Chessington. Uh, this is a little log flume uh, that I don't think uh, adults will be allowed on. Uh, I think it'll be kids only. But yeah, this got relocated from Sea Life, I think. The location of the sea life escapes me, so yeah, I'm not sure. But yeah, um, unfortunately, it couldn't be. Re it wasn't ready. It isn't ready for our pass holder day today. Uh, so yeah, it will be opening on Thursday when the park does open, like for its main season. So yeah, it's part of a new area. There's a new car ride over there, uh, obviously replacing Toadies. So yeah, there's two boats in the station. A few on the lift hill. Looks pretty good. So we've actually done quite a lot since we last boat here. Uh, can't remember now, I think we had another ride on Vampire, Dragon's Fury, uh, Rattlesnake, and we've just ended with a ride on Cobra. So yeah, that brings us to the end of the chanting over there. <laughs> so it is the end of the day here at Chessington. It's been really good. Park shuts at five o'clock, uh, which is now. So yeah, we've had a really good day. We've got on everything, loads of times that we've wanted to do. And yeah, it's been great. So thanks for watching. Uh, check out my Legoland vlogs t uh, from yesterday if you haven't already. And um, yeah, it's been a great day. Uh, like, subscribe and stay tuned for more vlogs here on Feedback Mad. I'll see you later.